Okay, hey, collector. So this is going to be a collective reading. So we have she loved life and then loved her right back. We have you don't have to say yes or agree to do things you don't want to do. I'm getting like you decided to focus on yourself here and somebody is straight up offended. Somebody is offended because you decided to focus on yourself. You decided you wanted to heal. You could have decided you wanted to be single. Somebody could have been like trying to pressure you into a relationship here. And somebody feels like, how dare you reject them? Somebody is trying to destroy you because you rejected them. That's what I'm getting here. Yep, you cannot make this up. Somebody is trying to destroy you because you rejected them. It's because you wanted to focus on healing and you wanted to focus on yourself. But somebody feels like they are going to take you down. This is somebody that's like low-key jealous of you here as well. Somebody could be in like competition with you or something like that. Somebody is mad because you are healing or you are happy and doing your own thing. I'm also getting somebody is mad because you are not desperate to be in a relationship here because you know your worth here. You're not desperate to be in any partnership. Yeah, you cannot make this up. I might as well end this reading. Somebody is upset because you decided to put time and energy into yourself. You are no longer investing all of your time and energy into this person. And somebody is offended. Somebody feels slighted. Somebody is pissed because you know your worth here. Or you want to focus on yourself. Yep. I'm getting like you putting this time and energy into yourself is helping you clear your energy. But you have somebody that's mad here behind the scenes trying to cause a tower moment for you. I'm getting this person is resentful because you decided to focus on yourself here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody is like trying to destroy your reputation or somebody is trying to humiliate you. I'm getting somebody could be a tattoo artist, but somebody is like trying to humiliate you or something like that. Yep, give a man a fish, you feed him for a day. Teach a man a fish, you feed him for a lifetime. This is on top of she loved life and then loved her right back. I'm getting like, you are a healer here. I'm getting like, you could have tried to help this person, but this person stabbed you in your back because you decided to focus on yourself. Somebody didn't want to heal. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody was like refusing to heal or somebody was like in competition with you the whole time you were in a relationship with them. You cared about this person. You were actually trying to help this person grow spiritually, but somebody was like resentful. This person was not growing because this person was in competition with you. I'm getting like, you realize that you need to focus your time and energy on yourself. And whoever this individual is, this person got pissed because you rejected them. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody got pissed because you rejected them. Yep, it's going to bite them in the ass. Something this person did to try to betray you here is backfiring. Somebody tried to like slander your name or something like that. Yep. Wow. I'm getting whoever this individual is, this person is pissed watching you stand in your power. I'm getting like you are standing in your emperor or empress energy here. That's what I'm getting here. And somebody is offended by this. I'm getting like you could have been very quiet here in the past. Somebody is watching you come into yourself. You are no longer blocking yourself from moving forward. You are taking your power back here because you decided to heal. And somebody is mad. Yep, this person is being messy. I'm getting like, this is a karmic soulmate. But this person is being messy here. Doing something behind the scenes. What's going on here? Yep, that's too many. But we have, I don't chase clout, I am clout. What's going on here? Somebody is watching you build a business here from the ground up. You cannot make this up. Yep. Somebody is realizing that you are a good person or this person knows you are a good person. You tried to help this person. Now this person wants to work with you. So now somebody wants to work with you here. Somebody is watching you build a business from the ground up. Now this person wants to work with you, but this person did something to betray you here in the background. Wow, I'm getting like this person does not like that you speak the truth. 
This person feels like you challenged them to grow. You don't allow this person to play the victim. This person feels like they have to take accountability when they are with you or around you. So this person got upset about that. Somebody could have tried to sabotage some, but you were like trying to help this person. You were trying to help this person. This person got mad at you. Yep. This person could have been trying to accuse you of being a bad person or something like that because this person was in victim mentality here. Somebody did not want to heal, take accountability, and take their power back. Yep. Look here. This person could have also been accusing you of I'm getting something in regards to like fraud here or something like that. What's going on here with this? Somebody could have lied on you here. Yeah, Rome wasn't built in a day. This is on top of beware. You're building a business here. Somebody tried to destroy your business or something like that because you moved away from them and you decided to focus on yourself. So somebody tried to destroy your business. I'm also getting this person is only one to deal with you because you leveled up. That's what I'm getting here. Wow, look here, collector. What this room wasn't built in a day, can we talk and they want your money? Somebody wants to deal with you because you leveled up, but this person left you out in the cold when you were starting a business. You were just starting a business. That could be why you rejected this person. You know that this person is only one to deal with you because you leveled up here. So this person like tried to destroy your business or something like that. Somebody tried to destroy a business that you built here from the ground up. You built this business from the ground up. This could be a friend you are dealing with here or a lover. What's going on here? Wow. Somebody felt like if they could reconcile with you and get in your energy, then you would go into business with them. That's what I'm getting here. And this person planned on destroying your business from the inside out. Somebody planned on getting you to forgive them, going into business with you, and then trying to destroy your business from the inside out because this person is jealous. Yep. Somebody is mad because you chose yourself here. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, you rejected this offer. So this person is trying to destroy you here. But somebody only wanted to reconcile with you because you leveled up. And this person planned on trying to destroy your business from the inside out. Or somebody is doing that now. Somebody is mad at you because you are focusing on yourself. Yeah, we have conditional life here. You believe your happiness depends on conditions changing. This is on top of can we talk? I'm getting like, you are happy with where you are at and what you have done, your accomplishments here. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody feels like they will only be happy if they see your business destroyed or something like that. I'm getting like, you are happy because you are trusting the process here. That's what I'm getting here, collective. You know that Rome wasn't built in a day. You're being patient with yourself in regards to a business that you are building here. That's what I'm getting here. You are taking things day by day. Something could have been moving slow for you. Whoever this individual is you were dealing with here in the past, this person did not believe in you. Somebody did not believe in you. Somebody expected you to level up fast or something like that, but something took time. Something grew for you over time. That's what I'm getting here. I'm getting like, you are patient. You are not in competition with anybody here. I'm getting like, you know happiness is an inside job. No labels, no titles, no achievement can bring you happiness. You have to find happiness within yourself. You have to find what true happiness is for you. That's what I'm getting, and you're doing that. But somebody you are connected to is mad. This person could have tried to slow something down for you. Something could have slowed down for you. But somebody is upset because you are still happy. I'm getting like you are trusting the process. This is something this person did in the past. Somebody was like trying to have people move away from you. That's what I'm getting here. Wow, I'm here. Somebody was accusing you of being a fraud here. 
that's not going to be for everyone. You know, a pot of roses, they fit. But somebody felt like if they ran people away from you and slowed something down for you, then you wouldn't be able to move forward. But I'm getting like, you are happy with the achievements that you make, the goals that you set for yourself. That's what I'm getting here. Like, you're not out here trying to outdo anybody. That's what I'm getting here. You know, a pot of roses, they fit. Yeah, somebody is extremely toxic. Somebody is addicted to your energy or somebody is addicted to what you have going on here or some type of business you are building. Yeah, somebody was trying to get revenge on you. Somebody is trying to get revenge on another person. Somebody tried to destroy your business here. Yep. You could have had a disagreement with this person. Agreement with others isn't required for your happiness. It's agreement with self that matters. Wow, look here. Like I said, you know true happiness comes from within here. Whatever this is that's going on here behind the scenes, somebody is pissed. Somebody is pissed because, wow, I see what's going on here. Somebody is mad because you keep pushing forward even after somebody tried to destroy your business here. Somebody thought that if they ran people away from you, then it would hurt your feelings or it would have you crushed or feeling low about yourself. Somebody was like trying to get you out of your element. Yeah, I'm hearing bitch don't kill my vibe. Somebody was trying to get you out of your element with some type of drama, but that shit didn't work. You kept moving forward. Somebody was like trying to get revenge on you or something like that, but it didn't work. You kept moving forward here. What's going on here? Yep. Yeah. This is somebody, somebody was just picking. That's what I'm getting here. Yeah, you're moving forward here. Somebody was just picking. Somebody just didn't like you just because. So somebody was trying to end something for you here. Somebody is mad because you decided to focus on yourself and they could not block you from moving forward here. That's what I'm getting. This could be somebody from your past. You are protected here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody knows that you are spiritually high ranking and you are protected, but somebody was like trying to get revenge on you or somebody is mad. This is a karmic. This is a karmic from your past or this is a karmic from somebody's past, but you are moving forward here. That's what I'm getting here. This person is going to watch you level up. Somebody tried to get revenge on you. And this person is going to watch you level up because you are protected by spirit here. That's what I'm getting here. The, whoever this individual is, this person is mad. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody tried to block you from moving forward. This person is watching you win and move forward. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is confused as to why they were not able to block you from moving forward. It's because you are protected by spirit. You are a good person. This is a karmic that did something behind the scenes here, something like that. Yep. This is somebody that's doing spell work on you. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is like extremely childish. This is a karmic that's mad because they got exposed for being karmic and doing karmic shit behind the scenes. Somebody is mad at you. Whoever this individual is, this person is mad at you. Somebody is watching you move forward. Somebody knows that you are a good person. That's what I'm getting here. This person is just upset because they got exposed for being karmic. Anything else here, spirit? Then I'm going to end this. Yep. Somebody is having to release your energy and move on with their life here or something like that. That's what I'm getting here. This is somebody that just does not like you. That's what I'm getting. This person is mad because you don't condone people using spell work to trap people in relationships. Somebody is mad because you don't condone using spell work and tampering with people's food and shit like that. This person is mad at you because of that. This is somebody that was desperate to have some type of partnership or something like that. Somebody is mad at you because their spell work is backfiring. Some type of spell work that they did on a masculine or a feminine, this is backfiring on this person. Somebody was warned against doing spell work to try to get somebody in a relationship. But instead of this person being mad at themselves because that's who they should be mad at, this person is mad at you. And somebody is watching you move forward here. That's what I'm getting here. Yeah, somebody is upset with themselves in regards to something that they did or they should be. This is somebody that's like refusing to take accountability. 
that's what I'm getting here. This is somebody that did not trust the process. This person felt like they would use spell work to get somebody in a relationship. And now that shit is backfiring on them and they're mad at you. And it's not your fault. You could have tried to warn this person. Yep, what's going on here? What's going on here? Yep, this is something that happened in the past here. Somebody was growing impatient. Wow, look here, collective. So somebody decided to use spell work on a masculine energy. And I'm getting like, this person is pissed because some type of spell work is backfiring. That's what I'm getting. And that's how it works. And somebody is mad at you, but you have nothing to do with this. I'm getting like, you could have just exposed that this person was karmic as hell and playing with spell work here. And now somebody feels like they're going to destroy you or something like that. Yeah. This person destroyed themselves, playing with spell work, being karmic, and not trusting the process. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. What's going on here? This person is unstable. That's what I'm getting here. Yep, this person is immature. Somebody is refusing to take accountability here. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is refusing to take accountability. This person is mad at you. Yep, this person wanted some type of inheritance or this person wanted some type of partnership or relationship with somebody that was financially stable. That's what I'm getting here. Yep, this is an opportunist. This is somebody that wanted some type of relationship or partnership with somebody that's financially stable. Somebody is mad at you because you exposed some type of spell work that this person was doing to get a relationship. I'm getting like, you removed yourself from this situation. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. This could be a friend of yours that did something here. You could have, look here. You can have a friend of yours that's like secretly mad at you because you exposed the fact that this person was doing some type of spell work to get a relationship with another individual here. And this person is like trying to befriend you or this person is like trying to link up with you. But it's because this person is like wanting to destroy your business because somebody is mad at you for exposing something that they did that was very karmic here. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is also mad because you leveled up on your own. Like somebody was wanting to partner up with a king of pentacles here in order to level up this person, use spell work to get this individual in a relationship. Meanwhile, you built a business on your own here, collective. That's what I'm getting here. And somebody is mad at you because of this. You have a friend that's extremely karmic, like... This person is a win-at-all-cost individual here. That's what I'm getting. This person did not care what they had to do to get this King of Pentacles in a relationship. And you exposed something because you knew something was wrong. And this friend is pissed at you. Yep. Somebody is now seeing the truth. Or somebody is mad at you because you exposed the truth. Yep, somebody is moving away from a karmic. Whoever this individual is, this person is like trusting their intuition here. Somebody is moving away from a karmic and this karmic is mad at you. That's what I'm getting here, yep. So somebody wanted to try to cause a tower moment for you financially or something like that. This person is mad at you because the king of pentacles left them out in the cold here. So this person is rushing towards you and this person like wants to fight you or something like that. This person is playing a victim and this person could be getting locked up here for something that they did. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody could be getting locked up for something that they did. Or somebody is trying to rush towards you with some very low vibrational energy. Could be trying to fight you. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody feels like you, wow. Somebody feels like you blocked them from bagging this king of pentacles here. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. And this karmic is resentful or this individual wants to fight you or something like that. This person is stressed out. Wow. 
this person is stressed out because you are intuitive or something like that. Somebody tried to have you isolated at work because they wanted to shut you up here as well. I'm getting like you removed yourself from this situation, but somebody's karmic is mad at you because you are moving forward on your own. You built a business on your own. Meanwhile, this karmic was trying to trap this masculine in some type of partnership here a relationship. This karmic is mad at you because you are intuitive. You expose the fact that this karmic was playing with spell work and all type of messy stuff that this individual was doing behind the scenes. So somebody's karmic is mad at you because the masculine energy moved away from them. I'm getting like, you aren't even dealing with this masculine. You may not even know this masculine energy. That's what I'm getting here. But somebody was doing something very janky behind the scenes in order to win at all costs playing with people's food, all of that nasty shit, and you expose this. Yeah, we have Monday here. We have even loss and betrayal can bring awakening. We have stop to appreciate the beauty surrounding you. Wow, that's too many. We have July here. We have food for thought. I'm telling you, it's something significant in regards to spell work or something like that. Or somebody betrayed another person or something like that. That's what I'm getting here. I'm also getting like somebody was like micro dosing another person. Somebody was doing something. That's what I'm getting. Or that was this person's plan. Somebody wanted some type of life insurance or inheritance or something like that. This is somebody's karmic. Yeah, this person is, this person could be going to jail here. Somebody is getting locked up. Somebody is getting locked up here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody was like trying to poison another person or something like that. Somebody's karmic is mentally and emotionally unstable. That's what I'm getting here. Yeah, we have January here. We have July. We have unconditional love. I'm getting like, you have a lot of love for this person. You also could have been trying to like encourage this individual to eat healthy or something like that. You were trying to encourage somebody to eat healthy or change their diet or something like that. Yeah, we have Tuesday here. We have balance. We have Sunday. Wow. I'm also getting like a step parent could have did something to a king of pentacles or something like that. Yeah, we have removing negative energy attachments keeps you clear and open. Somebody is mad because they are going to prison. Somebody is going to prison here. Yeah, we have it's not about being perfect. It's about being real. I'm hearing trust your intuition here. A situation is being balanced out. You could have been up in your head in regards to a situation. Somebody could have left you out in the cold or betrayed you here because you exposed the truth. Or somebody was like trying to destroy your business or shut you up so that you could not expose the truth. For some, this is a friend you were dealing with. I'm also getting like somebody has a friend that does spell work and you have no clue that this person does spell work. You could have said something and it low-key pissed this person off. You are not aware that this individual plays with spell work here. This person is like trying to destroy your business. This is like somebody that's like close to you or something like that. This person tries to come across as if they are your friend, but this person like low-key plays... This person is in a coven or something like that. You have a friend, while wow, I'm hearing that goes to church every Sunday, I don't know what this is you are dealing with. That's not going to be for everyone. But this person is secretly in some type of coven or clique. And this person did something here. This person plays with spell work. And you said something. And it pissed this individual off. And this person could be like gang stalking you. Or trying to end something for you here. But somebody is mad at you. Somebody feels like you betrayed them. Because you spoke on some type of spell work here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody feels like you betrayed them. This person is getting locked up here. Somebody is going to prison. This could be somebody that's mad at you 
because you reported them for trying to poison somebody or something like that. I don't know what the hell this is, but I'm in the there, Collector. Best of luck if this is you dealing with this or somebody around you. All right, bye, Collector.